Hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Shaudip Roy Chaudhary. I'm the founder and CEO of Eugenie.ai. In Eugenie, we are on a mission uh, to make operational industry more reliable. Uh, we believe that, like any other industry, AI is going to change the landscape of, of operational industry as well. We believe that AI is going to be that invisible force uh, for building a better world with sustainable system process, and Eugenie would play an important role into that. In Eugenie, we are on a mission to make operation more reliable by transforming people, process, and assets in every organization to become more efficient using AI engineering and design. Uh, we have a patented framework, SEEC, using which we not only able to detect and diagnose anomalies in from the operation data at real time or at batch, and able to triage uh, the next steps or the follow-up steps by finding out um, what if scenario on such data. The other important and pertinent issue that today operational industry uh, face is the ITOT convergence. Uh, in Eugenie, we are able to bring that convergence by providing them a single source of truth. Our solution and tool set helps IT and OT functions to uh, make use of the data and insight in a more holistic manner and having uh, a different view of the same anal analysis, which is uh, tailor-made for their requirement. And we do that using AI and ML techniques, uh, and that translation happens automatically by our platform. So a few of the specific problems that today uh, operational industry is facing are like unscheduled downtime, wastage due to production quality issue, or any deviation from the standard quality protocol, or disruption of in your production shop floor due to stress and strain in supply chain, or uh, the lack of human capital availability. To address such issue <clears throat> and to improve the overall reliability of your operations, um, which is again uh, more than a thirty billion dollar going to be a thirty billion dollar business by twenty twenty five. Uh, well, Eugenie brings on the table is how to use um, techniques like as I was saying before uh, from the AIML industry, how to bring the greatest and latest from the operational industry and then infuse them together in order to drive such efficiency. Eugenie helping such company. Um, uh, you know, such process companies like oil and gas in their digital transformation uh, journey by connecting their assets process uh, by using using a cyber physical systems as a first step. Then we help them to monitor the and track the KPI, the health KPI of business and processes uh, at real time via our operational strategy dashboard. Finally, we help companies to detect any anomalies, any deviations in their operations, and able to take the right actions as a follow-up using our prescription, prescriptive and descriptive uh, analytics platform, and with which uh, we also introduce the domain expertise and do domain knowledge in, in, in it, so that people can understand what that specific insight that are extracted from the data means in for their operation. By doing all of this, not only we help to democratize knowledge uh, and data within the organization uh, by providing everyone equal access to data, being it uh, they are part of operation team, maintenance team, or reliability team, or, or the, uh, the extreme end analytics team or IT team, uh, but also helps them to reduce uh, to t the time between the data or insight to action by using our platform. Number one issue, if you'd have asked me pre-COVID era and most of the United Nations uh, platform and people have been talking time and again is the global warming problem. And as we all aware of, operational industry and manufacturers are actually 
adding 80% to that. And that's the reason why you see, uh, especially process industry and especially on oil and gas, uh, uh, the top company CEOs are talking about how to become carbon neutral or zero carbon emission company by next five years. To achieve that sustainability in, their, in your operation, you need to have a better system, better processes. Now, of course, as I said before, the digital transformation is the only way by which you would be able to understand your process better and then maintain and track them better and keep the health of that operation in the best way so that it, you don't incur more losses or wastage uh, in your operation. With the same philosophy in Eugenie, what we are helping companies with, being it uh, oil and gas, upstream, downstream, or midstream companies, figuring out those hotspots in their operations which can be further optimized. For example, whether a machine can be further optimized to have higher uptime, whether a process can be optimized to reduce uh, unscheduled downtime, or whether um, some of the processes where uh, you don't, you can inspect uh, the health conditions remotely. Can you do it? And can we help you to do it? So all of these are helping you to build the, the equation of sustainability, whether it's respect to economical sustainability of your operations or ecological sustainability of your companies intact without sacrificing on the quality and the production throughput. So we believe in if the machines are working as expected in the most optimal way by which you will reduce wastage and by which you will achieve better sustainability and efficiency now some of the case studies that currently we are handling for uh, for oil and gas companies for example for midstream companies the global midstream uh, giant of uh, companies uh, helping them to consolidate hydrocarbon losses for the ta tank firms across region, figuring out what are the reasons for which, uh, whether it's due to external weather conditions or due to technical or non-technical determinants, they are incurring losses uh, in hydrocarbon across their tank farms. At the same time, some other midstream companies were helping them for their pipeline operations, figuring out whether there are leakages and what could be the potential reason for leakages, whether it's a corrosion problem or whether there are some other issue due to which uh, they are incurring uh, some unexpected deviation in their operation and helping them not only to detect such, but also helping them to figure out the right next steps and actions for the same. We bring more efficiency by bringing data and insight close to the user and so that they can interpret it better and, and bring them bring more actions to the operation. In Eugenie, we believe that uh, as like any industry I spoke of before, oil and gas is also going through a major transformation and rightly so. In a post-COVID when um, you will see that of course the demand will come back to normal and um, we are hopeful for that and we think that this is going to happen. Uh, then we need to produce more. Now what COVID has taught us is how to become more operationally uh, active in terms of how to become a more unit economically conscious. How do we produce the same throughput without with less OPEX? While definitely we're going to see a lot of uh, disruptions around human capital post COVID for this unfortunate reason. However, um, the operation has to go on. And to do that and to produce more with the with less or with the same, we need to improve our operations and where we see that well, Mid 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 Eastern uh, oil and gas company, they are the market leader as far as oil and gas productions are concerned, uh, concern, upstream operations, where we believe and we see and we have been seeing this that a lot of digital transformation is going to happen. And it's not, remember one thing, it's not only transforming your asset and process, however, how to use that transformed data in order to drive your operational decisions better is the main objective and should be the main objective for all these companies and come and technologies like AI big data, which now give us leave, uh, more 
ability to analyze this data at real time and able to detect and act on su any any such uh, cues that are coming from the data at real time gives us more benefit how to uh, you know achieve better efficiency uh, with less uh, dependency on human capital and bringing better human uh, better efficiency overall efficiency in uh, operations where we see that uh, ai big data iot technology are going to take a major role here and we think that eugen is going to play an important role and that's why not only with this solution that we have as i said before uh, we are going to help these companies but we also bring along a, st a strong partnership ecosystem uh, being it um, latest technology in the iot space from our partners qualcomm intel to uh, to the computational technology like uh, that come with our partner uh, ecosystem like uh, from our partners like azure aws to uh, the operation space partnership with sap or oracle so all of this uh, with this thriving partnership with this thriving ecosystem we believe that the overall oil and gas uh, operations going to be transformed and um, and like other part of the world middle uh, mid eastern companies are also going to change their operations quite uh, in the coming days so we are excited to be part of go digital energy middle east summit and we are looking forward to meet all of you in, uh, of course, this time not in person, but virtually. And we are going to showcase to you how with our, our solution suite, we are bringing ITOT convergence, how our C framework helping companies to figuring, uh, figure out operational uh, deviations and figuring out the right follow-ups and standard operating procedure by which they can address any operational deviation in their operation and functions. And we will show you the value that few of the oil and gas majors are seeing by using our solution in, in their operation. And I'm sure you will get benefited by seeing the experience that few of our customers have experienced with us using our platform. And I hope that for your own company, you will bring more excellence as far as operational operation is concerned, more sustainability as far as ecological and economy is concerned. And Eugenie will be your strategic partner and we'll learn together how we can be the next strategic partner for you. Thank you for your patience. Looking forward to see you all during the summit. Thank you.